All right, guys, what we're looking at here is a simulator that shows us what the particle motion would look like in a cold liquid and in a hot liquid. So here at the cold liquid, we can see that the particles are pretty close together. They're in motion. They're kind of moving and sliding past one another. Uh, but they're not moving as quickly as a gas, and they're also not in a fixed shape like a solid would be. So we can move the slider and observe how that will change the motion of the particles. So as we heat this up, we see the molecules start to move faster and they're kind of bumping into each other. But also we can see how the spaces between them are larger. So here in that hot liquid, um, we can see how as we've increased the temperature or heated the substance, we see the an increase in the speed of the particles. And we can see an increase in the spaces between the particles. Now if we cool this liquid down, we'd see a decrease in the speed of the particles and we see a decrease in the space between them. So this helps to show us what the particle motion looks like in a cold liquid and in a hot liquid.